Alright, uh, my minions, we are back. Had to do some uh, editing to get my video recording software to work. So, what we need to do is go talk to Silver Claws. Okay, so where did Silver Claws go? He was here. Huh. Secret passage! Dun dun dun. That's not good. So we gotta get down there. I don't know why I stole that. Can't really do anything front with it. Ah, I can sell that. I fell as a thief. Seriously, it's not letting me walk on there anymore. Weird. Okay. You're here, and relatively unskilled. Next is the significantly harder part. First, we sneak into the warehouse. Next, we observe our surroundings. Finally, and this is the most important part, you do exactly what I tell you to do. Yes, ma'am. You didn't bother to ask Silverclaw? Sharp as a barrel bottom you are. Silverclaw wants us to recover his ledger. Like a book? Have you seen those before? Squiggly lines, sometimes pictures, about as thick as your skull? Dancing girls and animal acts. It's a warehouse. Sweaty laborers and rough-hewn crates. What do you expect? Follow me, and keep quiet. 
There was no silver claw. Fortunately, because I didn't bother to talk to him, I got berated. I kind of deserved that, but there wasn't much I could do because, well... Guildmaster Zero. But yes, we'll need to get past that overseer to reach Silverclaw's old office. First, you'll wait for me to get into position. Then you'll distract him so I can knock him on the head. Here, take the stink apple. An alchemically infused apple. Throw it hard enough and it breaks open, surrounding your enemy with a rancid bouquet of boiled netch farts. Try not to miss. Make your way past the guards. Silverclaw hid the ledger in his old office. We'll meet there. Now wait until I'm in position. Then throw the stink apple. Lift with your legs, not your back, you fool! How do we get up there? Okay, seriously. I need to get my armor repaired fairly soon. Like I said, certain guards out there that seriously you just cannot beat Only one death. As I said in the first cleansing house video, and I think even partners in crime expect to die. 
I have fairly solid. I have solid defense. Um, tank built to take a huge amount of damage, but crap they dish out is serious some serious damage and I'm doing I do about 1k damage per attack and things like that and I'm doing nada to him I'll keep watch find the I wonder what would happen if you had no lockpicks. How much she would kick the crap out of you. Surprise, you fools. I'll collect Silver Club. Meet us back at the Thieves' Den. An explosion! Run to the nearest tavern! Run to the nearest tavern! I like the way that guy thinks. Question is I will. And you can see, in my defense, I did say I think my map's broke. But yet, what did I do? Kept following it. Oh, that's humorous. versus craft. Did she not say?
New member. Great. We could use the coin coming. Accounting. Inventory. Managing the futility of keeping the last few honest. You have any idea how hard it is to watch the coffers in a den of thieves? Hmm. It's like watching my sister multiplied by, I don't know, a lot. My sister and I would <laughs> have confident schemes for the wealthy merchants. She dressed the part. I dressed the ledgers. The guild offered security and an audience that could appreciate the performance. Hopefully, it can again. I'm going to stop you right there before the wheels start turning. If you need to get paid, I'll make sure you get everything. Twin, if you could believe it. I love her, but she drives me crazy. You would not believe how much she can spend on cards and notebooks. Work related. <laughs> Hot, maybe. <laughs> you know what? The really funny part about those lines is my dad's an accountant. And that's exactly what something he would say. That's exactly how an accountant sounds. I think that's awesome. And the real question is, where the frig... Alright, my minions. I'll do... Pause it here, figure out where the hell Silver Claw is, and go from, and then start it back up when I get there. <sighs> Hello, my minions, we are back. It looks like Silver Claw's been standing outside the freaking sh thieves' den the entire time. <sighs> You have the ledger? Was it all for naught? Oh, there is so much naught on your face. My heart shrinks in despair. But I am quite bad at reading faces. And in this place, my nose doesn't help. So, does the stink of victory waft about you? Wonderful! Would my perfidious overseers inconvenienced in any way? I do so hope they are bereft of convenience. Yet, the others who labor for me are blameless. Should they desire it, they shall have a place in my future endeavors. And now, to restore my fortunes from my humble shop. It is near the docks. You can't miss it. Well, you can easily miss it. I guess you took the long way. Don't rush me. The overseer mentioned someone coming to inspect the warehouse. Gosh, was it? Must be a new player. I haven't heard the name before I retired. Hmm. It always comes to coin with the Abar's land of merchant lords. Consolidate the competition, lock them in a set of gilded chains, then profit. Not that warehouse. My distraction made it undesirable. My own concoction. Then poured into a crate filled with sawdust, the crate emits a thick smoke. Any reasonable person would reach for a bucket of water to douse what appears to be oncoming flame. Yet, it reacts quite poorly to it. <laughs> it goes boom. The deafening bang is the least of it. The smoke increases tenfold, mimicking the mating odors of a female dragon frog. Every male dragon frog in the city should fill the warehouse by sunrise. Hope they confuse cautious shoe for a mate. I like her. She's brash, irritable, but she'd be. F but she seems a bit very fun and knows exactly what the hell she's doing. Okay. She's up. Back with 
without Belsa? Oh. Can't say I'm surprised. I've met camels less stubborn. Oh. I'm happy to hear Belsa plans to join us. Her skills will be invaluable. Not very convincing, was it? I'll need to practice. <laughs> Practice thinking with your mouth closed. Wish me. Here she is. Belsa, I'd recognize your grating voice anywhere. How is your retirement? Seems there are some troubles from which you can't run away. It's very relaxing, Guild Master. Did you know I named a weed after you? It grows taller than it should and takes more water than its share from the plants around it. <laughs> It's hard to believe. You were never the type of person to get your hands dirty. Oh, it's true. The Danazira weed thrives in the dark. I take great pleasure in cutting it down to size every day. <laughs> this should be pleasant, that these two. So there's a book down there. Alright, my minions. I'll end the video here. Get a good place to stop it. Uh, and then I'll go take a look at some of the other quests that we can start up. And we'll go from there. The writing's humorous. Thieves ends Because you have... Master Thief. He's retired. She was probably one of the best, if not the one of the the best. Former guildmaster, dad. Maybe. It's very hard to kill a thief. Um, new guildmaster. Who knows? She needs the old master thief, but despises her. Ah, the simple things of life tend to make you enjoy things and with that said my minions if you guys and gals like what you see please subscribe throw me on your favorites hit that like button if you got comments questions want to see you want to game with me want to see me stream anything please let me know and until next time keep on gaming my minions <laughs>